Hello everyone. Today I am going to present one of my self-written poem. This self-written poem has a deeper meaning. So try to understand it and grab more and more. My poem goes like this. Her favorite Orion constellation. Beauty lies in the eyes of beholder. And here the beholder was an almighty's creation who was gazing at the night sky. Never she got the answer of the question where could be the sky's center. But every night she kept thinking having faith on the phrase try try but never cry. The baby cub was living in the North America's grassland. The Paris humans call it. Her papa lion was the king of the grassland and always wore a handband and he was very much strict. Her best friend was a foreigner, a bear. She was called Grizzly and was very famous in the grassland as once a very big log she herself lifted. But Grizzly's birth brother Crusley sometimes acted a bit bizarre because he compelled his parents not to shift from Alaska jungles but even though they shifted. Grizzly's family was native of forests of Alaska but last year only they migrated to Perry's grassland along with many other bear families. As deforestation by humans was causing a great harm to their homes so some bears came to Perry's and the rest migrated to Nebraska. And after listening to their story for the first time, everyone in the grassland started cursing the humans' mentalities. Crosley, along with his gang of five other bears were only the revolutionaries against destruction caused by humans. But the rest of the Alaska jungle members were only involved in prayers. And thus Crosley's gang became famous as they fought against the humans who were equipped with weapons. Everything was going smooth in the jungle for around next one year when again those humans came and this time they directly shot an old bear dead. Hustle created throughout the jungle and everyone was trapped in fear and this time they had no other option lest spread. Today like every night again the baby cub was lying with her parents and was looking at her favorite Orion constellation and suddenly saw something flying, maybe a kite, but it was landing. Oh, it was a human who came there for invasion. Before that she could take any relevant action, the man shot bullets from his gun. She didn't know it was her last day to see the Orion constellation and I know what her last words would have been. I wish Mama, Papa and I could get a chance to run.